30,000 Palestinian deaths, not enough to move this Prime Minister to end arms sales to Israel. The killing of British aid workers, not enough to move the Prime Minister to end arms sales. It even seems that unlike the US, an all-out assault on Rafa, with all the death and destruction that would entail, wouldn't be enough. So just what on earth would be enough to finally move this Prime Minister into the same position as the majority of the British public and end arms sales to Israel? Yeah. Yeah. Mr Speaker, I just point out to the Honourable Gentleman that the UK Government does not directly sell arms to Israel, unlike unlike the US, and nor does the UK government offer any military lethal aid packages to Israel as the US does. So he should not conflate these issues. As part of the government's robust arms control regime, we do regularly review advice to ensure compliance with international law, and ministers act in accordance with that advice. Our position with regard to export licences, as he knows, is unchanged following the most recent assessment, and it is indeed in line with other partners, including the United States.